Hi students, welcome to BioBeam channel. Today we are going to discuss the need previous year questions. So which were asked on the chapter, uh, the living world of class 11. So if you have not subscribed until now to our channel, please subscribe to BioBeam channel for more chapters. Let's start without waiting. The first one, which one of the following aspect is an exclusive characteristics of living things? Isolated metabolic reactions occur in vitro. Option number B, increase in mass from inside only. Perception of events happening in the environment and their memory. Increase in mass by accumulation of material, both on surface as well as internally. And the correct answer is perception of events happening in the environment and their memory. Next question. The living organisms can be unexceptionally distinguished from the non-living things on the basis of their ability for. So option number A, interaction with the environment and progressive evolution. B, reproduction. C, growth and movement. D, responsiveness to touch. So the correct option is responsiveness to touch. Third question, biological organization starts with cellular level, organismic level, atomic level, sub microscopic molecular level. The correct option is D, sub microscopic molecular level. Select the correctly written scientific name of mango, which was first described by Carolus Linnaeus. So according to the rules of binomial nomenclature, the genera should start with capital letter, species with a small letter. And if uh, the scientist who gave that uh, scientific name, so can be written as uh, Len. So the correct option among this is C, Mangifera indica, Len. Next question. Nomenclature is governed by certain universal rules. Which one of the following is contrary to the rules of nomenclature? Option number A, the names are written in Latin and are italicized. Option number B, when written by hand, the names are to be underlined. Option number C, biological names can be written in any language. Option number D, the first word in a biological name represents the genus and the second specific epithet. And the correct option is C. Biological names can be written in any language. But actually, this is contrary to the rules of nomenclature. Next one. ICBN stands for, we have option A, B, C, D. So among this, the correct option is International Code of Botanical Nomenclature. Biosystematics aims at Biosystematic aims at the classification of organisms based on broad morphological characters. Option number B, delimiting various types of organisms and establishing their relationships. Option number C, the classification of organisms based on their evolutionary history and establishing their phylogeny on the totality of various parameters from all fields of studies. Option number D, identification and arrangement of organisms on the basis of their cytological characters. The correct option is C. Question number eight. The book Genera Plantarum was written by Angler and Plant, Bentham and Rooker, Bassey, Hutchinson. The correct option is Bentham and Hooker. Linnaeus is credited with, so we know he's the father of taxonomy, who is credited with binomial nomenclature. Linnaeus evolved a system of nomenclature called, so just now we were speaking about uh, binomial nomenclature. So that is the correct option. Question number 11. The term new systematics was introduced by Bantham and Hooker, Linnaeus, Julian Huxley, A.P. de Candoli. 
the answer is dantam and hooker we have column 1 and column 2 of uh, classification of house plan and then uh, we have to select the correct option here so we know that uh, the family of the house fly is musidae order is diptera class insecta phylum arthropoda the correct option is a so the common characteristics between tomato and potato will be maximum at the level of their so family order division genus so the correct option is family which one of the following is correctly matched with its particular taxonomic category have tiger tigris species cuttlefish mollusca class humans primata family house fly musa order so the correct option is tiger that is tigris species species are considered as real basic unit of classification lowest unit of classification artificial concept of human mind which cannot be defined in absolute terms real units of classification devised by taxonomist so the correct option is real basic unit of classification which of the following is less general in characters as compared to genus we have species division class family the correct option is species taxon is it's a real basic unit of classification the lowest unit of classification artificial concept of human mind which cannot be defined in absolute term real unit of classification devised by taxonomist so here the correct option is the lowest unit of classification sequence of taxonomic categories so here according to taxonomy hierarchy so they have given class phylum tribe order family genus species likewise we have b option c option d option so among these the correct option is c division class order family tribe genus species the term phylum was given by cuvier hackel theophrastus linnaeus so it is hackel a group of plants and animals with similar traits of any rank is species genus order taxon so it is taxon so it is any rank in the taxonomic hierarchy a taxon is a group of related families related species a type of living organism a taxonomic group of any ranking so again the correct option is d basic unit or smallest taxon of taxonomy or classification is species kingdom family variety the correct answer is species static concept of species was put forward by d candolle Linnaeus, Theophrastus, Darwin. The correct answer is Linnaeus. We have a massive column with uh, one and two, wherein they have given taxonomical aids at column one and the meaning at the column two. So herbarium, key, museum, catalog. We have options A, B, C, D, and the correct option for this is that is. fourth one that is d option the label of herbarium sheet does not carry information about date of collection name of the collector local names height of plant so here date of collection name of collector local names can be written on the herbarium but the height of plant varies according to environmental conditions and other factors so we cannot write it on the herbarium sheet the correct option is d which one of the following is not the correct statement so a museum has a collection of photographs of plants and animals key is a taxonomic aid for identification of specimens herbarium houses dried pressed and preserved plant specimens botanical gardens have living plant for reference 
So among this, it is not the correct statement. So the correct answer is A, because museum will not be having photographs of plants and animals. They are having dead plants as well as animals. One of the most important functions of botanical garden is that they provide a beautiful area for recreation. Option number B, one can observe tropical plants there. C, they allow exit to conservation of germ plasm. D, they provide the natural habitat for wildlife. So here, the vast important function of botanical garden. So we can say they allow exit to conservation of germ plasm, wherein the plants are conserved in the controlled condition.